Hi students, welcome to another problem in uh, another video in development of surfaces. I am Dr. Vinod Kumar, adjunct professor in Cochin University of Science and Technology. This problem is quite interesting. A frustrum of a square pyramid whose base is 40 mm and top is 40, 20 mm square through a height of 60 mm stand on the base. I repeat, frustrum of a square pyramid, 40 mm side of base. 20 mm side of top through a height of 60 mm stand on its base. What's the plan? Plan is a square, 40 mm side. Inside that square, there is another centralized square of 20 mm side. I have marked the dimensions 40, 20. A, B, C, D corners of the base. E, F, G, H. Corners of the top. Drawn the elevation. Height is 60. Height of the first one is 60. Height of the first one is 60. You are asked to find out the shortest distance between a corner of base and the opposite corner of top. Shortest distance. Where is the corner of base? A is the corner of base. What is the opposite corner of top? G is the opposite corner of top. So you are asked to find out the shortest distance between A and G. Or B and H or C and D, or D and F. Whatever it be, you have to draw the development. How do you draw the development? You need to find the apex. How do you find the apex? Take, find the center of the square O, draw a horizontal line through O, make an arc O as center, O A as radius, A1, project it to XY, A1 dash, extend the sides, so that they meet at O dash. O dash is the apex actually. This is the apex. O dash is the apex. Now what? You have to connect O dash to A1 dash. O dash to A1 dash. What is it? It's a true length of it's a true length of slanted jaw of the pyramid, full pyramid. If the full pyramid is existing, this is its true length of slant edge. This is TL. TL. Now take that distance, take that true length, choose O anywhere and draw an arc. Take the starting point A, take the distance AB and cut B, C, D A Connect Connect this by straight lines A to B, B to C C to D and D to A Connect them to O you Extend this Cut it Take that distance and mark What are the E F G H, E, connect them, E to F, F to G, G to H, H to G. What is this? This part is the development of lateral surface of the frustrum of square pyramid. Now, connect B and H in the development. By a straight line. B and H, straight line. Can we connect B dash and H dash here to show it in the elevation? No. Can we connect B and H in the plan to show it in the plan? No. What you have to do? You have to locate this point K. Where is K? K is on OC or GC. Take this distance OK and mark K1 dash. O dash K1 dash equals OK. Not there. Mark it on the true length. Mark it on the true length. K1 dash. Mark it on the true length. K1 dash. Now where is actually K dash? K dash is on G dash C dash. This is K dash C dash. Go there. Straight line. 
What is this? This is k dash. Now, where is the path? Where is the path? B dash k dash k dash g dash is the path in the image. A dash, I mean B dash k dash k dash h dash b k h b k h which is represented by b dash k dash h dash in the elevator what about the plan drop k dash down to what to g to g c k b k k x is the plan So, this is B, K, H in the plan. Capital B, K is B dash K dash H dash in the equation, B dash K dash H dash in the equation, small B, K, small B, K, H in the plan. Interesting, nice question. Similarly, you can have other questions. Say, and what's the shortest path between a point at the center of a side? To the center of the opposite side, what do you have to do? Connect this center to this center. Like that, you can have any number of questions. Only thing is that don't take it directly from there to the elevation. Go to the true length, go to the true length, and then come to the elevation of the respective edge or side or whatever it is. Okay. Thank you.